Hey guys, what's up? This is Sniper Snape, and today I'm going to be kind of going over the new updates that have been released for March. Wizard101 releases a bulletin for every month, and this month is March, so there's going to be... Stop animations. There's going to be some new updates, uh, kind of that reflect what type of holidays or uh, festivities go on in that month, like March is going to be St. Patrick's Day. So, they're releasing a character for a short time named Pat O'Gold, and she is going to be kind of like a St. Patrick's Day slash spring type character. It says she sells St. Patrick's Day wands and a new pet, so if you want to go check that out, uh, you can go do that right now because she was released yesterday, March 2nd, so if you want to go and see if you can uh, purchase that pet, go ahead. It's probably with crowns though, so make sure you have some crowns on hand. Um, the March Raven 1 Bulletin is also what they usually release every month, one of the bulletins, and we're going to go ahead and check out this one. So we already talked about Pat of Gold. Also this month, a another character, Egbert, will be arriving, and he will be selling items that are spring related also. Egbert's probably more on the lines of spring and Easter if you celebrate that, so he will also be taking crowns for whatever he is going to be selling that will be spring related. New book of the month, Rabbit Problem, also refers to spring, and a new abracadoodle if you're interested in reading that. So, I'm going to go ahead and go over to the game updates now. February released a host of updates for, like minor updates for the game, that they just kind of tightened up a lot of stuff, like combat, they, um, for example, they uh, updated the underwater casting animation to look correctly, so there is a lot of updates that they just kind of were minor tweaks that they had to fix to tighten up the game so if you have an interest in looking at all of these like spell updates and stuff like that you can go ahead and read through all of this so the other thing I wanted to talk about was the crown shop they help to they want to help to organize it and make shopping faster so they added some new tabs that will only show you a Thames rings amulets and housing items so it's easier to get to those and access them more quickly in the crown shop if that's what you're looking for so other miscellaneous updates if you are interested in that so I think that's it there hasn't been another producers letter they're still talking about Zafaria so hopefully we have information on another world or at least a side world which I, I'm looking forward to because I want to get that level 70 gear which uh, in the past they've released through a side world like Crab Alley they released the level 60 gear so looking forward to that and that is it that is your March game updates I'm Sniper Snape and have a nice day